Hello everyone on YouTube, Ben Murray here with you, glad to be here. I uh, wanted to come back and kind of give you an update on how things are going with my eSight glasses. I know it's been a year since I uploaded a new video, so I thought it was time for a new one. Well, things are great. Um, moved into a new house and uh, living independently, which is great. Uh, and that's what eSight does for a lot of folks. It gives them independence and so forth. Um, there are a lot of videos on YouTube about the glasses, but they're mostly um, how that you know they're mostly uh, brief snippets. But I want to give you a rundown of how they look and work. I, I know I did one previously, but it wasn't the greatest. I have a new camera set up and so forth as well. So I'll be glad to uh, share what eSight Three is and how it looks and works and so forth. Um, I've been a user of this technology since 2016 when uh, eSight 2 was uh, the unit that they had. Then they can, you can still uh, get eSight 2 if you'd like um, for a more basic unit. They still do sell those, I do believe. Um, but this is eSight 3. This is the headset piece. Um, a lot of people dub this, you know, Jordi LaForge, you know, style type glasses. And, and it does. It's visory, as you can see. It tilts all the way down, and that's completely down in front of my eyes. Um, it does tilt up, though, which I do. I like to keep it about here and look straight down. Uh, but this is the front of the headset. This is the camera, and behind here are the two screens, as I have uh, shown you uh, before. So this is the controller. Um, this is what it looks like. And these are available in white, uh, by the way, as well, not just black. Uh, this is the zoom dial that goes up to 24 times zoom. Um, this trackpad is for panning. This is for exiting the menu. This is for freezing an image and saving it. And this resets all of the manipulations you've made with zoom or focusing or um, other things like that. Over here on this side of the control unit, we have the focus knob which allows me to focus nearer or farther, and this is the contrast. Now, both of these uh, have toggle functionalities in them. If I push this once, I'm in manual focus. Once again, distance mode, back to autofocus after one more push. Uh, up here is the contrast mode. I can change color, uh, gray, uh, gray on black, yellow, blue, yellow and blue, or blue on yellow, grayscale, and back to normal. Um, over here also is a, is a belt clip. Up here in, in this little door, which I'll open, I usually don't, but I want to show my viewers what this is. Uh, this is the charging port over here, and this is for HDMI. And here is an SD card for all your pictures that you can take. Yes, this unit does take pictures, and you can save them. Uh, with this button here, this takes pictures. Uh, the current pricing of eSight is $5,095. I'll include a link to eSight in the description below. Um, and you'll be able to go to their website. You can book a demo. You can look at videos. My story is on there. Uh, it's titled Dayton, Dayton, as in Dayton, Ohio, Never Looked So Good. And they base that title off of my first demonstration to, in Dayton, Ohio, on August 12th, 2015. Um, but these are a great technology for those that are legally blind or visually impaired. Um, they help folks with diabetic retinopathy, optic, optic nerve atrophy like myself, um, all kinds of eye conditions. Uh, a complete list is on the eSight website. A uh, little disclaimer, uh, this video is intended uh, or was recorded by me, not at the request of eSight or any of its affiliates. Um, this is, I, I get no compensation for doing these. Um, I just do these out of the goodness in my heart and to make people aware that there is hope for uh, your vision loss. Maybe you're sitting at home right now wondering, you know, is there a technology for my son? Is there a technology for my daughter, my niece, my nephew, my, you know, my granddaughter, my grandson, my husband, my wife? And you're going across YouTube and you come across a personal story like mine or a personal video rather like mine. Um, I raised my funds for the first unit that cost $15,000, 
with the help of my generous community. And that's what I tell people. Go to your churches, uh, start a GoFundMe campaign. That's what I did. Uh, they were great, and it, or it was great, and I raised more than enough to get my first pair. Uh, this pair was purchased on my uh, with money that I had saved up from leftover funding from the uh, fun, uh, leftover funds from the beginning or from the first fundraiser. So, um, again, the cost of this is five thousand ninety-five dollars. Uh, it's not covered by insurance that I know of as of yet. Uh, you can book a demonstration on eSite eyewear.com and they will contact you and you can try eSite in your home. I believe it's for $99 for seven days. And if you're interested in purchasing in, in eSite going forward, the, the, 99, the $99 deposit that you put down will go towards the purchase of your glasses. Um, if you folks have any questions, please feel free to comment below. Um, I ask, though, that there are no, hatred, uh, no hateful comments. Uh, these videos are not intended to be funny or things like that. This is a very serious matter. Uh, vision loss and legal blindness is a serious thing. Um, these do not help those that are totally blind. I should note that. And you cannot drive with these. Um, there is no peripheral vision in them that's, uh, that is uh, legal enough to drive. But you can watch TV, go to the movies, go to the mall, go out with friends, cook, clean, read a book, read the newspaper, go to, go to a play or a show. Um, I was able to go to a Cleveland Indians game with these when I first got this upgraded edition and the previous version as well. So you can go to sporting events. You can go to concerts. Um, I use these in tandem with my white cane to show people that I do have a visual impairment. And uh, it's just a wonderful, wonderful thing. And it's a, it's, it's a wonderful gift, too. So like I said in the beginning, I will include a link to eSight in the description. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Have a great, uh, great night, and thank you again. And I will talk to you in the next video. Take care.